I got the idea for the trip two years ago while I was uh, safety kayaking on a commercial trip on the upper Klinaklini River. We get picked up by this helicopter and I'm looking downstream and totally curious about what's down there and why no one knows really anything about this gorge other than that it's unrunnable. Yeah, we started doing research and then we found we were we were planning an expedition. Three of us did a scout flight in a Cessna over the gorge. It felt really good to finally get eyes on on the gorges and on the canyon and um, there was definitely some some really big white water in there but we had tried to time it uh, late in the season and it was going to be be big but I did think it was going to be doable. We put on super fired up and the first day went really well. We uh, we had two two big rapids. and we're on day two and yeah it rained all night and the river definitely came up all of our gravel bars are covered all these trips that had been essentially dry or very low water were just pumping water in there was also you know really thick mist and fog that was just rolling up the the river corridor and there were times where you couldn't see, you know, 20, 30 feet in front of you. And it was a super ominous feeling. We also had three islands that were sort of our marker point of knowing that we didn't have that much time before the big first slide, which we had all decided, especially with the water rise, was going to be a portage. <laughs> 